Hello, friends. I'm back yet again. Um, yeah, so in my latest uh, experiment here, um, what I've done is I have uh, a very large uh, neodymium magnet. Um, actually, actually, there's two of, two of them. Um, one on top of the other. Uh, each one has a, a pulling force of 130 pounds, so together that's 260 pounds of force. Uh, you know, that's not really uh, necessary for what I'm doing here. Uh, let me just show you. Uh, I've got a got a um, high voltage uh, neon transformer uh, uh, 900 and or 9500 volts at about uh, 30 milliamps and what I'm doing uh, which is quite similar to my past experiments is that I'm creating an arc which will rotate and uh, you know, you can think of the arc as a sail on a boat, and uh, the magnetic uh, whirlwind as you know a wind that pushes the arc. Um, yeah, you know, I already uh, saw this on another YouTube experiment. Like someone else did the same thing. I'm just kind of uh, copying it because I recognized what that person was doing and I thought it was interesting. So, uh, without further ado, I will turn it on. And nothing happens. There we go. Okay, it's kind of hard to see, so what I'll do is I'll turn the light off and hmm, okay one second here um, let me see what happens oh there we go, yeah okay that might make it a bit easier to see it looks pretty uh, neat I'm not sure if the camera captures the um, aesthetic quality as well as it could. Alright. Um, yeah, so that's basically it. Uh, what I was thinking is that um, I could actually turn this into sort of like a, um, a horizontal uh, Jacob's Ladder. Uh, you know, if you're familiar with a Jacob's Ladder, um, it entails two pieces of copper with an arc that 